Because you are that, you are capable. You are gifted, and you are so unique. All of the things that you may hate about yourself are your strengths. It's okay to be soft. It's okay to be opinionated. It's okay to be different. And it's so okay to just be The world awaits to receive you. Bitch, I'm back. I'm popular the man. Bitch, I'm back. I'm popular the man. Bitch, I'm back. I'm popular the man. Now you know I was gonna do it because I know that's annoying for some people, and I love it. Yes, I'm back. Happy New Year. Yes, you're here with Grace Levi coming in differently, different, differently different this new year. Yes, I'm excited. I hope YouTube, I'm not I'm I'm learning how to play the streets, okay? So that's why we're here for it tonight. Now we're gonna move on to just another short update because this is another focus topic that I'm gonna talk about and do a whole like mm, not a series but just a live on Tory Lanez and Meg the Stallion. Y'all already know that I hit this topic a while ago where I was saying something differently different from everybody else that I did not believe Mr. Tory Lane shot her in the pinky toe. I apologize. The foot. Okay. I do believe something did happen to make the stallion. No disregard to that because people be up in their panties in the bunch about somebody they don't know. The reason why I'm talking about this because not only does it affect the black community and um, law. I like law. And y'all interested in it. And I like rap. You know, put it all together. That's why we're talking about it today. Now, as we know, Tory Lane's driver has submitted statements alleging he saw Kelsey with the guard you now. And Twister is in scrambles, okay? Thoughts. So we know that um, Meg Thee Stallion came out and made a nothing statement. We're going to show that in the live that we do. As well as we didn't hear anything from Kelsey. Because Kelsey, you know how to sh um, mouth at the end of the day. Snitches don't get stitches. No, I don't promote that. But what I'm saying is if you involve, you do something, it's better for you to do it by yourself. Because if you don't, you're going to be ending up in a situation like this. Also... Don't be fighting over peeing. It's really not worth it, okay? Alcohol, peeing, and I guess disregarding your celebrity status will get you in a situation like that. So this particular topic, we're going to do a focus live on because you know I like court. And allegedly, he filed a habeas corpus. And habeas corpus is that he want to get the hell out of jail, release the body. Release the body because there's an issue or some constitutional um, questions that he wants to ask to a higher court. So that's something that um, I don't know if people understand the breakdown of the law based on research and based on looking for other case laws and things like that. So that's what we do here because that's what I love to do. We're going to get into it because that habeas corpus, they're taking it to the appellate court. You got to have a standing. What was wrong? So the transcript should be out from the old case, okay? Kelsey said, I'm going to shut my damn mouth because I'm not a fool. Mm -hmm. I'm not Meg. Now, let's get into Mr. Jay-Z, okay? This is something else we're going to be getting into the New Year's. Uh, um, we're announcing a lot of our, like, focus topics tonight, too, because we coming in hot for the New Year's 2014. This particular artist right here is one of the biggest mainstream artists as well as him and his wife that is known for witchcraft let me shut up i'm just playing allegedly you know i'm not playing but um with that goes to say um mr jay-z new york proposed a bill that will create jay-z day to celebrate his fest which includes being an innovative entrepreneur okay so, I'm not going to get into this reading this article because I'm disgusted, okay? This is a waste, and um, no, I didn't say that to when Tupac got a street, okay? I'm not hating because I know somebody in the background, like, you ain't say that when Tupac got a street. He don't need a day, though. Tupac changed people's mind, his heart, their hearts, made them 
you know, stand up for themselves outside of, you know, some of the things that happen, you know, in the industry that kind of corrupt people as well. But he wasn't the only one, not making excuses. But Jay-Z didn't do nothing. He hear what he did. Even with the football, don't forget, you know, I'm not big on football. That's why it was easy for me to not watch it, allegedly. Allegedly black community. What did we get? What did we get for the deal? What did we get for the boule? Okay, I do have a video out about the boule that um, highlights information from one of our great ancestors, Mr. Steve Coakley and other people from, you know, different timelines, different places. Because, you know, I try to go back that talks about the boule and how they behave. I'm not saying he's a Pacific boule, you know, or doing that all the time. You know that? You know that. Not doing that. He don't do that. But, uh, yeah, we're going to get into it. But if you think that he deserved the day, hit the like button. All of Jay-Z, just hit the like. I'm just trying to steal free likes because I don't believe he deserved it. And I'm moving on. I'm just going to say that. Would you like to learn a brand new and innovative way to invest your extra money that has a low barrier to entry and low competition? What if I told you that it is a guaranteed method to get up to 18 to 20% return on your investment? Tax lien and deed purchasing is the only way to get into the real estate market through the back door. No credit and no loans needed. This method isn't commonly taught and therefore the competition is very low for now. Put together a 14 hour info packed course which will teach you everything you'll need to know to get started. Learn at your own pace, step by step, guided video and aids to start you on the TLC deed investment process. The course offers many learning tools for new investors helping ensure you safely invest in tax liens and deeds. Contact us today and join the buyback team.